So we literally just got Guardians of the Galaxy. By the way, Chris Pat, whatever your name is, I hate you. I hate your guts. My wife <laughs> literally watched that little dancing scene. If you haven't watched it yet, there's this little dancing scene where like, it's like it's five seconds of hip hips resting. And I literally <laughs> caught her, like just <laughs> literally just came in. I wish I had the camera. Where she's just so focused on the show. Yeah, there you go. Thank you for joining our family. We're happy you're here. Everybody. So, um, it's just me for right now. Uh, me and my wife haven't really done much uh, videotaping today. <clears throat> um, she's been having some serious problems with her uh, PCOS. Um, so, I've been trying to take care of her, been very worried about her. Uh, she has had some, I mean, uh, her PCOS has been really acting up lately. Um, the cramping, she's been vomiting almost all day. Um, the fact is she's been bleeding, she had her period, and she's been bleeding for almost like a full month now. Uh, tomorrow we go in to uh, see what might be going on. Um, there's a good chance that they may just say that, you know, you're going through PCOS and uh, if you want to stop, go on birth control. Of course, we've been trying for a baby for a long time now. Um, and I know, it, it, like, she's not ready to stop, even if it's bothering her health this bad. Um, so I'm definitely praying to like try to figure out what the best course is for us and what we may need to do. Um, anyone who's watching, I mean, if you pray, we could use all the help we can get. Um, if not, just even a nice little comment will make my wife's day. Um, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Like I hope everyone is, you know, having a good week. Uh, so on the list of trying to make my wife's day, we're having a nice little time with some movies. Got her some movies I'm hoping she'll enjoy. She is an avid Disney fan, as am I. So we got Tomorrowland. You cannot see that, I don't think. Sorry about that. I'll hold up anyway, just in case. Uh, next one up is Paul Blart Mall Cop. Um, I know she saw the first one and she enjoyed it. I heard the second one was not good at all. I'm not saying like the first one was Shakespeare or anything, but anyway, give it a try. We'll see how it goes. Next one up is Unfriended. Uh, I am a huge, huge horror fan. Love monster movies. I know they are about as horribly scripted as you can get, but I'm an avid fan. I, I love it. I'm not gonna say they're great. Um, <clears throat> So I'm not sure if she wanted this because of me. If so, I love you, baby. But I know she's been asking for it. So just in case, if this is what she wanted, I definitely got it for her. So, we want to have a nice movie night. I'm going to surprise her with some um, breakfast. Or not breakfast. I don't know. It's, it's in the middle of the night, honestly. It's been a long day. Um... Yeah, we've been going through it. So we're going to cook something for my wife. We're going to surprise her in bed and we're going to watch movies. Yay. Fettuccine, chicken, cold Alfredo. <sighs> There's my baby. Hopefully feeling a little better. Excuse me, I'm pretty sure that, um, You've seen this pajama duo <laughs> in another video. That does not mean we're faking days. It means I reuse my pajamas over and over again. Yeah, I mean, if you notice, I wear the same pants every day. I'm not washing them every day. I'm just wearing them every day. That's not true. He just has a whole closet full of white t-shirts and sweatpants. <laughs> I love him for it. So we got our meal here. 
Chicken Alfredo. I was going to surprise her. We were going to surprise her, weren't we? Yeah. <laughs> but, um... I woke up. And then I she basically, him. like, helped me make it all. Thank you, oh, Mrs. Thank Chef. You. No, I mean, like, I didn't know that I was ruining a surprise. I was hoping that you hadn't, like, gone out to the store or something. I know. Because I woke up and you weren't <laughs> in the bedroom. Came out here, you weren't out here. So it was just like... Where are you? Mm -hmm. I texted you first and then you sent me a picture of what you were doing upstairs. She's impossible to surprise, isn't she, guys? Aren't you? You're impossible to surprise, huh? Sorry. Yeah. Well, surprise. What happened? Oh, our No. We got money? <laughs> oh, the red box. You went over there. You're so sweet. And can you look into the camera and say surprise? Surprise to me. Thank you. Mission accomplished. <laughs> no, I'm really excited. We um went to the red box the other day and it was I'm sorry, my hands shaking. Sorry. And it was got all excited over the surprise. It was outside, it was raining, so we were just like, you know, we'll come back another day. Mm-hmm. Or no 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 no. What had happened was is that we went to Rent some movies, and they were like, oh, this is your first time using Redbox, so you can't mm -hmm. get more than one. So we literally just got Guardians of the Galaxy. By the way, Chris Pat, whatever your name is, I hate you. I hate your guts. My wife <laughs> literally watched that little dancing scene. If you haven't watched it yet, there's this little dancing scene where like, it's like it's five seconds of hip, hips resting. Ooh, and I literally boy. caught her, like, just <laughs> literally just came in. I wish I had the camera. Where she's just so focused on the show. Yeah, there you go. Oh, I was swimming. It's getting and she's just hitting like rewind again and again. Well, now I'm gonna again. hit rewind on your little dance with <laughs> baby cakes. <laughs> I have no idea what you even saw, but it's like, and you just like hip scratching. I'm just like, seriously? No, I really. Thank you, Chris Pratt. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, and sorry, Anna. That's his wifey. <laughs> sorry. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, um, in all seriousness, um, I don't know what happened, but I woke up sick this morning and was just a miserable little chipmunk, and my husband had plans to go, um, up to Portland, mm -hmm. the Portland area, let's yeah. go with that, um, to meet up with some of his friends that are, um, joining together to do, you know, his gaming channel that we keep talking about. Mm -hmm. Um, but he opted to stay here with me. Um, I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. Zoom in on all of that. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, um, let's go up the nose. No. Sorry, guys. You'll see boogers. No, I'm just kidding. But, um, so I just want you to know that I really appreciated that. And I want them to know that I appreciated that. I love you. I love you. I hope you're feeling better. I am. You'd be surprised how just, like... You know, aside from everything else, like, some sometimes just some good old-fashioned sleep yeah. can, like, really help. That's true. That's true. But I don't know what happened. Like, I, like, got up out of bed. Like, I fell this morning. She did. I forgot to mention that. Uh, she got up. She was super dizzy. She fell. I that was a little bit scary. It really was. I mean, I could see you were in, in your eyes. You were completely, like, just distorted at the time. PCOS is no joke. But we're okay. <laughs> um, sometimes you have to, like, you know, like, set pride aside and not try to be, like, um, you know, superwoman, superman, whatever, and just be, like, you know, today is a day that, like, I need to, like, put me first. Mm -hmm. And I encouraged him to go on with his plans and that didn't I? You did. Um she's extremely supportive. And that I would be okay, but thank you for making me your priority today. Of course. You're always my priority. I love you. I love you too. That being said, I think we're probably gonna be done for the day. Um yeah. Thank you for joining our family. We're really glad you're here. I'm sorry we didn't look that way, but we are. 